This is Adrian reporting for ESCplus.com and I'm here in Sakuzur Hall reporting for you all guys uh, next to Esther Basic and Emily G. They're performing the song Homey Klaus. Tomorrow in the final. And guys, you went on stage today for the first open rehearsal for press. How did it go? How did you feel there? I felt excellent. Like I said, I'm done with the rehearsals. Like I just want to perform on the stage with audience already so I'm very excited I just I just want to perform that's that's it that's all I want to do do you need to make any adjustments to the performance is it anything you need to fix or any camera angles or something that you need to um, no not not from today basically we from semi-final um, yeah. we made some adjustments um, that's what it was going to change yeah, uh, yeah, ask that, yeah that's the thing with uh, with semi-final if you compare that and there's lo lots of changes um, we hopefully made things better and um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, um, what did you um, take you to send the song uh, to Esti Laul and try to represent Estonia at the Eurovision Song Contest? What made you send the song here to Esti Laul? Well, actually we just made the song and uh, because the deadline was so close to our finish line, um, we just sent it and just uh, thought about, well, let's yeah. see how it goes. The song basically was just, just made for like a single release, you know. Okay. We, we made Extra Basic with Eager, um, we just thought that it'd be a great song to release and I think this song was made, um, was already ready yet in May 2018 mm -hmm. but everything you know like goes goes further like mm -hmm. some delays and, st and st stuff like that and I think it was like in October or something we we had cover arts ready we had the instrumental ready we had everything ready and we thought like oh we have one week from the deadline on Estelaul and then we exactly we that, send it, yeah. that's what I was going to ask you if you had planned to send this song only for Estelaul it was something that was just previously made and, and yeah yeah okay that was previously made and we just thought you know just just give a shot you know and yeah. had you ever previously thought about the chance to compete in Estelaul or is it like something that came all of a sudden like it was um, how did it well, it was very sudden. Um, I remember we were watching like yeah, the TV, like kids. when they um, when they said the Estelaul, like the qualification. Qualification. Yeah. Yeah, and the <laughs> and we were watching it, and it came by as, as a surprise yeah, for all of us. We didn't expect that. At okay. All. Yeah. So. Yeah. Um, how are you feeling the competition this year? Is it like tough for you? Is it good? How how do you see the competition? Oh, it's very this tough. Year? In my opinion, last year La Forza uh, was like everybody knew already. Mm. Like th the others didn't have to compete anymore. Like everybody knew that La Forza is going to represent Estonia. But this year, I don't know. It's very tough. The competition is very tough, and uh, like like anybody could go. Like I'm not sure who will, but yeah. It's, yeah. it's, it's really like it's. The quality is so high, you know, for for each com contestant, that is, you know, it's really hard to judge who's mm -hmm, gonna go, mm -hmm, who's mm -hmm. gonna who's gonna win, who's gonna get second place, even mm -hmm, like, mm -hmm. and the odds are really, you know, from place to place. So. And how much are you feeling the love from the fans and the people here in Estonia, and well, also internationally, if you're receiving yeah. com comments yeah, from? The love is, the love well, is crazy. our video is still like the most Number watched one. out of like ASTL. Yeah, in, in the competition, we can say we can say I that. that yeah. yeah, we can say that we really crushed it on social media. Like, uh, yeah. like we not not to brag or anything, but we are number one in YouTube, number one, uh, num number two in Spotify. We're like constantly like interacting with fans on Twitter. It's really it's really fun. Like, and especially on, in the semifinals, we got through thanks to the uh, tele uh, televote. Yeah, televote. Yeah. And that shows that you know there are people behind us. And how was the reaction from the televote? Because I think it was like uh, on a later stage before it came the jury yeah. votes and the televote like combined, and then you you knew that you were going through thanks to the televote. So how did you expect it? Well, I was almost losing hope yeah. because oh. we were the very last ones to be called out, and uh, honestly, I was losing hope. That's what I did. And when they said our names, I was like, ah. Yeah. Oh. Yes, thank you. I was so grateful. And does it bring you down your expectations? Like the jury didn't vote that much for you now? Or is it like a good hope to, to show something else? Yeah, you? I think so too. But this year it's all national jury, yeah, really which is, I think, great yeah, for us. Very great, yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I've heard that they judge based on the semi final. I hope so. I hope it's not the case yeah. mm -hmm. but if, if it is it's not like no worries because they've heard the radio version of it as well as I've heard um, but I don't know like we uh, kind of I don't lose hope 
if if you know the judges didn't give us points because because I know for a fact that there's lots of people like standing with us they're voting they're like we have our whole families friends and like there's there's many of them like we, on social media as well are like the the presence is so strong for us that that I don't I don't know like I'm I'm kind of confident but I, I don't I don't want to like push it too okay. much. Like, you want to say something? <laughs> yes, about what <laughs> exactly? <laughs> <laughs> Everything was said by Andre right now. Okay, but um, maybe you are going to Eurovision in case you win. As the the winner goes to Eurovision Song Contest. Yeah. How are you approaching the Eurovision in case you win? How will you approach the experience because it's something huge, it's massive, and you are going to be behind the name of a country. So, how does it put pressure on you or? I think we'll approach it as we approach the semi-finals and our finals here in Estonia. We uh, we already approach uh, semi-finals like it's the Eurovision. Everything must be perfect. The camera angles, choreography, the uh, Emily uh, singing, and but right now we feel that we are already ready for Eurovision. Okay, that's good to hear. Actually, yeah. Yeah. Uh, apart from Eurovision and SLL final, do you have something in mind in order to I don't know for the release or make something together again in the future or any plans in mind? Release a single or an album or. I don't know, like together? Well, sure. I mean, together. I th I th I'm, in, I'm down. <laughs> but uh, yeah, down. but uh, I think we're, we're all friends. So yeah. even if uh, I'm not going to be singing, I'm down to songwrite with them. And we're still a team. I mean, we've been together for the past, I don't know, three months, so much. And uh, yeah, I'm very grateful. Like, you know, the, the competition is like so huge that maybe like we'll take a couple of days of rest after this ends but right now we're already like so motivated to do like things further like we with eager we have a plan to make an al album mm -hmm, um mm -hmm. that's that's our goal for this year and yeah basically write a lot lot lots of songs and see what happens basically yeah perfect okay guys um i let you the camera uh if you want to send a message to the viewers on escplus.com feel free to this say spain right uh well, actually it's kind of international thing it's yeah. europe but also spain so feel free to hola España. <laughs> yeah hola <laughs> and hello hello europe um we w we want to say um we're so grateful for your love we really feel it and yeah. uh, we're so thankful that you watch our videos you listen to our yeah. song and uh Anything There's else? Like lo lots of support from from like international, from yeah, from Sp from Spain, and from international. yeah, yeah. There's lots of support from outside of Estonia, and that's really crazy to see. Like, and if if you know if you have something like if you want to talk to us, you know, go on Twitter. We reply to everything. Oh yeah, we love Twitter. All right. <laughs> 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 just discovered Twitter, but uh, that's fun. That's fun. But anyway, um, we hope you enjoy our show. We hope you enjoy our song. Um, we wish you the best. I hope. You wish us the best. And yeah, we'll see what happens tomorrow. And yeah, hope for the best. Thank you. Thank Bye. You. <laughs>